Hi DIY fans, DIY with Elle here and I'm on to another room makeover on a budget DIY style. Okay, so this is a spare bedroom or a single bed bedroom and it's a pretty spacious, well lit room that can take in a lot of light. Let's get started on the feature wall of this bedroom makeover. I cannot wait to show you what paint accessories, what paint colors I'm going to use and paint products to create this arched effect with a pop of color that's going to add a lot of warmth and some modern vibes to this very, very bland, outdated room. So the first step is clear the space. Take all the furniture out so you know what you're working with with the wall and we won't be using this furniture for the makeover. To protect the floors for this paint job, I'm using Hamilton's Super Soak Matte. It's multi-purpose, it's absorbent and protective. It's also made from recycled material, which I absolutely love. It's super absorbent to quickly absorb those nasty spills. And for the paint, I'm using a one liter Easy Living by Plascon. You won't need more than one liter in the color cinnamon. Next, you're gonna need some string. This is gonna help you draw the arch. And you'll also make use of a hammer and a wall nail. So what I'm doing here is using the string to measure the length of the diameter of the circle, which is from one end of the circle right through to the other. And then what you do is you half that to get the radius. And that half is the size of the arch. Next, I'm using a pencil and tape measure to make sure I find the middle of my wall and the length of the bottom half of my arch that I wanted to span. It's around just under a meter. And I'm using a level to make sure that my lines are straight going all the way up to the point where I wanted to stop and the arch to begin. Next, I'm using Hamilton's masking tape to mark off on that line that I drew with the pencil because I want crisp lines when it comes to this arch and then I'm going to paint in the interior of the arch with a beautiful Plascon Easy Living from the Paint Club, Color and Cinnamon. Find the center of the width of your arch and hammer in a nail. That's where I want the arch to start. And as you can see, I'm using my string radius measurement and I'm holding a taunt with a pencil at the end, stretching, keeping a taunt and gently marking out the half circle or the arch. Next, because I'm a perfectionist, I don't think I have such a steady hand, I'm using small pieces of masking tape and putting them along the line of the arch, which actually works. Now we can get to painting. I'm decanting this beautiful color into my Vela roller tray set from Hamilton's. I love the size of this roller. It's perfect for the job, as well as this Vela roller doesn't create bubbles when applying the paint. What I love about this paint is it is multi-purpose. So you're not gonna use the whole one liter for this type of feature wall or paint application. So you can use it for other things. It's low sheen, it's for interior and exterior. And I just think it's super quality, washable and durable acrylic paint. I'm so glad that the paint club offered their advice to me when I was talking about doing this DIY project. Here I'm careful with the Vela roller, making sure I'm going in the same direction as I applied the tape as to not remove the tape. Just applying the second and third coat. Don't forget the skirting to get right up to the edge there. I've applied tape and I'm using my Hamilton's professional paintbrush in the size 50 millimeters. Applying the third coat and just before it's dry, you can remove the masking tape to reveal crisp lines. How satisfying. It looks great. Now we can decorate the space, which is one of my favorite parts to do. I built this DIY side table. I bought the mirror from a store and I'm just putting the finishing touches on the space. I love the colors. I love how crisp and clean it looks. I love the warmth that it brings, the different textures, 
and it's just a modern take on doing something with a bland wall inside your home. Wow, what a difference. You can easily do this paint technique in your home and it is so much fun. Be sure to visit a paint club store near you. They are the paint experts giving you exceptional brands, quality and service all through South Africa. And pair your paint product with Hamilton's range of paint brushes and rollers and paint accessories. I thoroughly enjoyed my free consultation in store and I made life easy with their exclusive range of easy living paints from Plascon. Visit paintclub.co.za for more information. Also visit hamiltonbrush.co.za for the perfect finish. Keep smiling and DIYing.